As the mercury drops, though, many are looking for ways to warm up in their home. A space heater is a really good idea because they're cheap, they work, but safety is very, very important, and so is efficiency. Too. Yeah. According to Xcel Energy, Energy Star space heaters can save up to 20% of household energy use. And to share some hot hints on space heaters, TCL lawn and garden expert Mike Fratelloni of Fratelloni's Ace Hardware joins us. Welcome back. Hi, guys. Okay, so we learned all of our fragrance in the last segment. What's your fragrance? What's like an enchanting like, scent you're wearing. Let me see. Let me see. Lava soap. Like, yeah, yeah. Lava soap. <laughs> Two cycle oil, gasoline. It's all those. It can all be found yes. at Red Lonely's Ace Hardware. Right. Anything you can spill yeah. on your garage floor. That's what I smell like. Because yeah. you roll in it. Yeah, that's right. Very good. Well, I, I bet you're selling a lot of space heaters right we now. Are. People got a, no. got some concerns about them, though, because, you know, we mentioned the efficiency and can save on energy, but, but safety is definitely an issue. It's very, very important. You want to buy a space heater that doesn't have a hot red burning coil. If you can see a red coil, you're probably going to be able to light something on fire. Well, I know today what we're going to do is give you three problems that a lot of people have out there with their space heaters or what they're looking for. Yes. You're going to give us the solution. Let's do it. And so it's, it starts with the first one, which is about safety. And the problem is I don't want my kids to be harmed by the space heater. That's a big, big concern for a lot of people out there. What would the solution be? Well, that, this one's a really simple one. It's called an Eden Pure. You can put your cat on here. Your kid can sit on here. They can reach up front. And it doesn't create combustion, so it can't light newspaper on fire. You can put it right up against the couch. It does run on about 1,500 watts, so that's a lot of power. Okay. But it's still very, very safe. Will it say, you know, heat up a big room? It does, about 1,000 square feet. In fact, if you turn your heat down to about 60 degrees and run this, you can really reduce your heating bill because this can heat the rest of the space that you're living in. You know, it's not going to heat your whole house, but if you have it in your family room and you're sitting in your family room, that's a perfect spot for it. Any downfalls for it other than it, the first thing I think is it's pretty big. It's a little big. It's $397, so you have to really oh, cut yeah. down your furnace to use this. That's the way you save and make yes. it and pay for itself. But it's extremely popular right now. In fact, the biggest downfall is, is pretty much everyone sold out of them. But... Well, and the other thing, you talked about the, the, the cost in $400. I mean, that's a lot of money, a space heater. But you talk about your kids. There's no price mm -hmm. in your kids' That's right. So. Yeah. Your kids can touch this one, and they're going to be totally safe. Okay, let's take a look at problem number two that we have today. Problem number two is I don't have a lot of room in my home. Which space heater is good for me? And people in condos, and uh, especially condos, I would think, myself included, that's probably the case. So a lot what of is the solution that. for that one? You know, there's some very easy ways to do it. In fact, this one right here, this is called a radiant heater, and you mount this actually on the wall. So you would mount it under your desk or by your kitchen table. And it doesn't have a fan to blow the heat out. Mm -hmm. It just radiates heat. So if it's sitting under your desk, your leg, in fact, it's called Cozy Legs. It's a great name. <laughs> and it will keep that. your legs cozy. It is definitely not going to eat your whole house, yeah. but it's going to heat the five square feet around it really well. Here's okay, the good yes. news and the bad news that I noticed right away. I mean, it's it's clean looking, it's, it's sharp looking, it can blend right into the wall. Sure. Do you have to be concerned about your kids coming close it, to it? It doesn't this? get hot but, enough that you, can, you, know, you don't want your kids, of course, touching it, yeah. but it does get warm, but not blazing hot. Okay, good. Yeah, it doesn't get red hot. It's not going to burn the wall down. But the one thing I love about space heaters is it blows heat on you. Sure. I, it doesn't look like and that. This one, one doesn't that, blow yeah. heat on you. It just kind of radiates warmth towards you. <laughs> so you <laughs> like the sun. Like What's yeah. the price on this one? <laughs> about $46. About $46. Oh, that's not it's, not, it's very inexpensive. Very inexpensive, yeah. All right, now on to problem number, number three, which is I have about a space heater for over 20 years. Which one is best for me? So this what solution be, would you say? This Probably is somebody whose space heater isn't high on their list mm -hmm. in terms of priority, but they've got one. Well, a lot of people are, you know, if, if you have one right now, you want to make sure that it's not old, antiquated technology, first of all. These come in a nice little case. It's safe. It has a fan, so it's going to blow the hot air onto you. And it's not going to, as long as you're not jamming paper in it, you're not going to be able to light things on fire. If it tips over, it automatically shuts off. A lot of old heaters do not have those features. So it's very, very important, you know, just to... Make sure it's updated. That's a $25 heater. It's not going to bust the bank buying something like that. Right. And you take a look at it, and proportionately, I guess it's about the size of a plate. Yeah. You know? mm -hmm. so and it's just, it's not going to heat your whole house again. And it's not going to heat a bedroom, but it's going to heat an area by where you're sitting. So you're, and you know what? This is what I see most often around the office and everything. A lot That's of people right. have them underneath their it's desk perfect for you and stuff like that. So again, if you're, you're looking to get back in the market of space heaters, or if you just generally want a space heater, this is probably the one you're looking at. It's, a, it's kind of a no-brainer. Okay. All right, now we've been promising people that you have some hot hints for us. I do have some hot hints. <laughs> Perfect, with the space heaters. Yeah. Hot hints? Yes. There's a, one thing that you want to do 
is you do not want to overload your electrical outlets. If you plug some of these into some outlets, they're 1500 watts, it's the same power as your toaster. You would never want to plug your toaster, a heater, your hair dryer into the same outlet, you're going to blow your circuits and you don't want to do that. Another one is the heaters take a lot of moisture out of the air. So if you're using a heater that creates a lot of combustion, it can take both air and moisture out of the air and that's definitely not what you want. Dry air doesn't heat as well as moist air. So run a humidifier or don't run your heater all day. Just run it during the day, not at night. And you say, yeah, keep it warm, not hot. That's right. You want to have a heater like this Eden Pure. It creates a lot of warm air, but not a lot of hot air. Why is that? Because it's just it's engineered a little bit better. That's why it won't light anything on fire. A lot of the cheaper heaters create only a little bit of really hot air. But what's, but, the, what's the benefit to keeping it just warm and not hot? It doesn't it's, go straight to the ceiling. Okay. So hot air just goes straight up to the ceiling. You're losing it. Gotcha. You know, so you put that down by your feet. You're going to get your feet, and it's going to go right to the ceiling. This one, at least, gets it all the way through the room. That's why it's four hundred dollars compared to thirty. So the really your favorite is the Eden. It's a no. It's a no-brainer if you have the four hundred dollars. All right. Yeah. Great. Thank, Thank you, you guys. Very much. Great love as always, having me here. Appreciate it. Love Fratelloni's Ace Hardware too. Hey, I do too. <laughs> I spend so much money there. You want me to get out of the way? Yeah, yeah that's right. Stores now. I go there all the time. Yeah. <laughs> all of the space heaters featured today are available at Fratelloni's Ace Hardware. And for more information, head on to our website. Just go to kstv.com and click on Twin Cities Live.